everybody, this is Praxis, and there's been a lot going on today on site. We have today, tomorrow, and the following day are supposed to be all dry. If you look over behind to your left, there's a bunch of boards that have one coat of paint. Uh, uh, I keep calling it paint, it's a, seal, uh, it's a wood seal. Uh, a couple of them already have their second coat. There's a bunch down there that are ready to go up on the backside. River has been doing uh, initial coats on a ton. Actually, all the stuff you see initial coats, that's pretty much all his work over there. I've been taking things that have uh, the second coat on, getting them cut to size, and putting them up there. My dad's here also today, and he's uh, helping to prepare the uh, you know the final work like for the soffits, which is like kind of the things that hold up the end of your roof that are going over this gable end. We added some additional extensions of roof material. Initially, we had terminated the roof at a certain place, and just in looking at it, we. I think the consensus was that it was pretty ugly. Uh, it was just too short and we needed a little bit more. It's much nicer now. We were able to make that out of some scrap that we had had. The kit company always sends one extra piece of roofing material. Uh, so we, you know, in case something went wrong or whatever. So we had that extra piece of roofing material. We took that, we cut it in half and we took each half and added it up to the end here. And I think it makes it look like a much more attractive uh, finish for the roof. Additionally, it's gonna uh, offer a little bit more rain protection. So my dad's been kind of orchestrating that and getting things ready to actually get that boxed in. But we can't do the boxing in, creating those soffits, until all the boards are up on that side. I was able to uh, finish uh, to the halfway point today. So I don't know, depending on time, maybe we're gonna be able to start working on one of those soffits on the south side over there. But as you can see, there's still lots of boarding work that I need to do to you know, get this side completely done. Uh, what else has been going on today? Uh, Amber was here briefly. She did a little sanding. She did a little bit of uh, sealing also. But uh, that's pretty much the deal. It's just it's really cool that we have uh, 48 more hours after today of drying time. We can just get as many of these out sitting. And uh, I think the next 48 hours is going to be just getting as many of these done up on the wall as we possibly can. But uh, yeah. It's been really nice, I gotta say, working on the uh, on this little deck that we put over here. It's it's easy up, easy back and forth, easy to work. Oh, the one other thing I want to mention, I had about 10, maybe even 15 minutes of delay today because there was a bat. There was a bat up under the roof, and we were going to slide the uh, piece of roofing material up there. I heard some squeaking. I thought it was a mouse, uh, maybe. I look in there, and there's a bat, and you know the bat it just wouldn't leave. We were trying to like finesse it out, and it just kept wedging itself further and further up. Uh, it took a while just to get the bat to a safe position so that we could continue work. And as far as I know, the bat's still up there and probably very angry at us. <laughs> That's it. Thanks for watching.